Bene. Hello. 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 Hi. 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 So we are here in uh, Tokyo <laughs> with uh, some new friends and colleagues, and uh, we got hosted for uh, by them for more than two weeks, and we could exchange a lot because we did so many things together that we could go a little bit deeper on what we thought we had in common and now we can say we have many things in common and many way to approach uh, our uh, working experience and to approach life. Um, my name is René Carras, I'm an associate professor at Toyo University. I teach classes around innovation, entrepreneurship, design thinking and I was very happy to meet them, Giulio and Lorenza. Uh, because what I teach, we are doing it. And it was like a, a perfect match. I think it was very interesting that like, during these two weeks they participate to an event I organized which is called Creatoyo, five days of interactive training with people from the industry, with students, with academic. And we talked a lot about creation and one of the books I will advise you is called The Act of Creation from Arthur Kostler. He's a philosopher and he explained in a beautiful way what in a beautiful way what you should do to be creative and one of the key words is be associations. You should bring people, you should bring concepts that are a little bit far away and when they click, something new can appear. And I think it's what happened in the last two weeks. Yes, and uh, this is what we're working on. Me and Lorenzo, we um, developed a, a, a model which is called Multifactor Model which um, is a way to keep together people who want to work together. So it's a model for entrepreneurs and uh, uh, artists and uh, uh, people with a creative mindset to work together on their own, uh, own projects. And uh, basically the idea is that if you gather together people who are very diverse and if you uh, give them uh, uh, a set, uh, like a frame, and also a set of rules, so a governance system which allows them to interact without uh, start to fight, then uh, things will happen and they will be wonderful things. Mm. And um, this is something which uh, uh, for us is important in working environment, but not in working environment. Yeah, I think what you were saying, um, it's uh, like a, a mode uh, of uh, life for us, but it's also something that uh, we retrieve through the workshop, like this uh, openness and uh, flexibility, this idea of collaboration and putting together different people from uh, different ages, different cultures, different disciplines, and uh, make these people find a solution to a common problem has uh, generated uh, a, a lot of uh, creativity. And uh, this is uh, what happens on the education level that uh, Rene is doing uh, at the university. This is, I think, what happens with you trying to activate the communities in the multifactory you uh, have to work with. And this is uh, what we try to do in activate different groups of people that uh, are active in the neighborhoods uh, through their Pan Gorillas uh, NGO that I represent. Um, and I think these values uh, of community, we share them also in our uh, daily, everyday lives, this openness, this acceptance of other people's values and trying to find different ways to collaborate with one another despite our differences. Yeah, because it, 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 the, now everybody is talking about creativity and everybody wants to be yeah. creative and uh, everybody should be creative and uh, then you meet those uh, people at, uh, those very funny and uh, um, energetic business meetings in the evenings when they give you one, two, three, four, five free drinks and you are there and they say, oh yeah, we are so cool, we are so creative, let's get people together now, yeah, we'll talk, yeah, and then everything will happen, yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, yeah. for us, this is bullshit. The next day, nothing that happens. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, 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 mm. and the creativity is something which works only if there is a, a knowledge and if there is a system which forces this creativity mm -hmm. and uh, which uh, then um, makes it possible for people to create things. Uh, because creativity mm -hmm. means to create, not just to think about, uh, oh, very cool stuff. 
and, and to create the things that are meaningful, it means that we have to have meaningful uh, relationships between the people we are with. So it's not this superficial meetings between people. It's like, yeah, we have to get together and do things and create, but it uh, really has to derive from uh, a common derivative that uh, we want to connect with the other person as well in uh, Yes, and, you need, levels, yes. and you need the systems for people to interact uh, and the projects uh, and uh, things which are thought uh, to help people to come together, mm. like Kretoyo mm. and... Mm. Mm. Yeah, the, the other interesting thing is that Kretoyo was uh, uh, made by students, just students from the university, professors, Memura Sensen, you, so Japanese professor, European professor, and professional and entrepreneurs. And this diversity, mm. that's the thing that brings out creativity mm. because you have mm. all different point of view and at the same time it was horizontal. So we attended for uh, four days, six days, mm -hmm. uh, something that was, uh, everybody was equal in the sense that everybody was different mm -hmm. with a lot of differences because a professor is not like a student and is not like an entrepreneur. So everyone was <laughs> coming with his own knowledge mm -hmm. and he was trying to fit into this uh, uh, environment uh, with uh, bringing what the best he could bring uh, uh, from his point of view. But at the same time it was horizontal, there was mm -hmm. no hierarchy. And, mm -hmm. uh, and this thing is something that uh, is important for us to build these environments where there is no mm -hmm. hierarchy and there is an horizontal governance where everyone has his own role, has his own brings, does what he can do, but uh, the result uh, is made all together by, by the environment, mm -hmm. by the community. What, this is uh, what we, we are exploring in this moment and in, in how to bring out that and in Kretoria this was happening so that's why we, we like it a lot. Yeah. And I learned one technique from Professor Laurent Simon at the end, he should ask, you know, if you had to remember one thing of these two weeks here in Tokyo, what would it be? One thing. This experience in Tokyo. Oh, so many things. <laughs> <laughs> the one thing is difficult. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because, uh, I mean, for me, it was the first time in, uh, in Japan and the first time it's mm -hmm. only once. So it was this time and uh, the, 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 to learn an, a different culture, to try to, to, to learn a little bit and you, you understand that you don't know anything about it. And then to go deeper and to see differences and, uh, and, uh, and to think why we are so different. We are all humans. That the thing. We are all belonging to the human human being, but we are we developed so different cultures and so different ways mm. of uh, living. And wow, that, so there is something new we can develop. So the world is not ended. So structure are not uh, societies are not ended. Now we think uh, we are we are done. No, no, no. There is a lot more, more, many more societies, many more structure, many more communities we can think about and improve, improve it. So I think that we think uh, improve it, improve it, uh, and build the new societies. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, for me, uh, the most uh, interesting I bring home is that. Um, um, we also came to, uh, to make a short visit to Toyota Motor Company and uh, uh, they say, okay, uh, we developed the, our uh, Toyota model because after the Second World War we had to uh, do something in a different way, not just to copy. And then many people came, came to copy us, but it's not just about, they couldn't because it's not just about uh, um, making things in a certain way, but it's about uh, deeply understanding and deeply um, uh, fitting a system to a uh, social system. And that's what we do and that's what I believe is really true. Uh, Japan, uh, Europe uh, are very different and of course also different countries in Europe. You can also have good models, we have good model, but then you need to find a way to let the model interact uh, on its own with the social system. And we found that uh, um, when you uh, apply the same model in different environments, uh, different things happen, 
But the different uh, communities have to be free to self uh, uh, understand uh, how the model works uh, and to adapt to their own needs. And um, this is something that uh, we really, uh, really think is the key for the, the, uh, to make a new um, good business and to make a new good societies. And uh, this means going uh, uh, far away from the classical structure of the pyramidal society, which is uh, our comfort zone, because in a, in a pyramidal society every, everybody can find their own space. If you are uh, aggressive and if you are competitive, you can say, okay, I want to go up to the, the, the top. If you are just a relaxed person, you can say, oh, I will stay on my own and nobody will, uh, will tell me anything. But this is just our comfort zone and this is not fitting the uh, environmental and the societal uh, um, problems that we're facing now. And uh, uh, what we think is that uh, horizontal structures which are faster and uh, which can much more adapt to single, uh, to single um, specific uh, situations and conditions can work better. So one model which can adapt and which can be uh, understood and create new shapes with and within the communities. This is what uh, I recall. Uh, Wow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, uh, I'm staying home, I'm not going anywhere, so I have to adapt, uh, continue to adapt uh, in this situation in Dogyo. Well, uh, some, just some thoughts after the conference and uh, that we spent together was, actually, I, th I believe there is a need to rethink uh, Creativity, because what we see going on now is that, okay, we have to be creative and we have to do design thinking workshops and design thinking workshop. There is this order and you have to empathize, to uh, think too, and there is an, okay, and you have to do these things for uh, to create them, um, to generate creativity. But uh, what I'm wondering and I want to reflect and to improve is, to break away from this uh, predefined model of thinking creative and move to more um, uh, problem, uh, move to a more, uh, to a different model to problem solving and not this linear process and try to create a more um, a different, uh, a different process to generate creative ideas. Yes. Okay, thank you very much. Yes. I would say what I learned is co-creation is very important mm. by mixing people from different backgrounds, different nationality, different age, uh, different gender. Mm. Uh, I think that's how we can create mm. new ideas, that we can generate new projects. And as you said, it's a work in progress. Mm. Creativity, it's a complex process. It's not a linear process. And we still have to work on, so that's why come next year in Tokyo, Korea Toyo 2021. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Three out of 22.